I'm here to discuss the importance of your personal brand when searching for a new job, especially if you're in the middle of a career change. Your cover letter, resume and online presence creates a first impression for a potential employer. They will help you stand out from other candidates and influence your opportunity of getting an interview. Knowing how to write a cover letter is essential. You can infuse your personality and connect with people in a way that resumes can't. There are a few basic steps to writing a cover letter. Introduce yourself to the hiring manager, list the job you're applying for and where you found out about it. Outline your professional background and explain how your skills align to the role. Write why you want to work for the company and what you can contribute to their objectives, visions and culture. Thank them for considering your application, including a call of action and how they can contact you. Make sure what you're writing is relevant and structured. Ensure to stay clear of the overly used to whom it may concern. Rather, find out who the hiring manager is and address them accordingly. Don't send out the same copy and paste cover letter for every role. Rather, make sure you tailor your cover letter for each role, allowing you to highlight the key skill set that you can bring to each opportunity. Also check your formatting as well as your content and be careful of any typos and grammar issues. Top resumes that attract the most attention outline your value to the company in a concise yet impactful, easy to read reverse chronological order. Employers will be looking for essential information such as the contact details, career strengths, employment history, education, training and referees. You can also provide links to your social profiles like LinkedIn. Secondary details that will boost your resume are personal career objectives, tangible and intangible skills, responsibilities and achievements. Include industry keywords a recruiter will look for as they scan each resume. Many hiring managers now look at tertiary information like hobbies and interests to establish a culture fit within their organisation. This also allows you to showcase an aspect of your personality and can also assist in being a great conversation starter. A common phrase at the end of a resume is references available upon request. An employee may require one or two referees, for example managers or ex-colleagues, in the final stage of recruitment. Today's job seekers have an extensive digital footprint, so employers naturally have a more transparent view of your life. Popular social media channels like Facebook, Instagram, Twitter and LinkedIn are record keepers. Here are three tips for enhancing your online presence. Consider what you post, share and comment on and how freely available you make your accounts. Interact respectfully in public forums. If you cannot remove embarrassing content online, consider creating more positive content so the good posts rank higher in search engines. Visually make sure your online presence is consistent. Use the same profile photos and write in a similar manner. So what's the next step? Your cover letter, resume and online presence are your number one personal marketing tools. If you're interested in learning more about the job seeking process, check out our other videos or contact one of our friendly team members via ransat.com.au.